So we'll begin, as always, with a shout out to Squarespace. Thanks for allowing us to be here at CES 2016. So in walking past the HP booth, the thing that immediately grabbed my attention, of course, was the Star Wars co-branded laptop. Now, to be perfectly clear, this is not a super high performance machine. It's a 699 MSRP machine. It comes with a Core i5, 8 gigs of RAM, a one terabyte hard drive, a 1080p, but fortunately IPS display in a form factor that's not exactly groundbreaking by any stretch of the imagination. But what it does come with is just a pretty darn cool concept. And the Star Wars branding is more than just skin deep with Darth Vader on the top cover, a stormtrooper on the wrist rest, and even packed packaging that comes in the shape of a TIE fighter. You actually get a ton of exclusive content with it, with everything from visuals to sounds of the machine optimized for the Star Wars fan, as well as I think it's something ridiculous, like 1,100 photos in a gallery that comes with it, as well as all the trailers in full resolution. It's got a couple of accessories, like this uh, soft shell case, as well as a sort of, I don't know, it's, it's, it's sort of an average feeling Bluetooth mouse, clearly for the Star Wars fan, but not necessarily the kind of thing that I would otherwise geek out over, although this is really cool. The touchpad itself has Luke's readout from A New Hope as they go down the Death Star Trench, so that is a pretty cool touch. But then I came over here and they're like, well, hold on a second, actually. This is the star of the show. This is the new folio. And I'm like, okay, so it's a business laptop. It's an elite book. Those are cool. They tend to have really nice glass touch pads. They tend to have outstanding build quality, security features, things like touch uh, fingerprint sensors. This one actually doesn't have that, but supposedly with a wink and a nudge, they're investigating other biometric technologies. So it's actually, it's obviously got a, actually that looks like a real sense camera. Is that a real sense camera on here? I'm getting a bunch of shrugs, but there's two lenses on the top. Okay, it is definitely not. So all they'll tell me is they're investigating other biometric technologies. I can't tell you guys more than that. But the things that I do know are the speeds and feeds as well as the form factor of this sucker. So it's using a Core M processor. It's a fanless design and they've basically taken all that extra space, not to mention the extra power that comes along with the Core M, and used it all up to give you better battery, a rock and sound system, and hold on a second, I will get back to that in a moment, as well as by far the best keyboard I have ever encountered on an HP laptop, this size and this weight, which is not really saying anything because they've never done anything this thin or this light before, but it actually does feel surprisingly good. Now back to the audio quality, why would that matter? They actually talk about this thing. I heard two reps screw up and call it a phone because they really do intend for it to be used as a business phone, whether it's individually with the 720p webcam and not to mention the dedicated hardware Skype buttons for hanging up and muting all that cool stuff, but actually just as a collaborative device. So you can sit down, use the 180 degree hinge, sit across the table from it, and boom, now it really is legitimately more phone than computer. I think that pretty much wraps it up. Oh yeah, no it doesn't. It comes with a 10 hour battery life with the full HD display. It features an NVMe SSD up to 512 gigs. They're quoting 10 hours of battery life for the 1080p, but uh, they won't say anything about the 4K for now. We can probably assume it'll be about two hours to two and a half hours less than that, depending on screen usage. And I think I'm pretty much done. Yes. Oh, yeah, the audio system is Bang & Olufsen, if that matters to you people who think Bang & Olufsen might be a fairly reputable audio brand. So thank you guys for checking out this video here at CES 2016. Guys, remember, our trip to the show this year is powered by Squarespace. If you want to build a website, build it beautiful, head over to squarespace.com slash Linus, use offer code Linus to save 10%, and don't miss any of our CES content by getting subscribed over at youtube.com slash Linus Tech Tips.